Hey everybody, it's Marty from Aspect LED. Today we are going to take a look at our DMX decoders with XLR ports. All right, this comes in both a three channel and a four channel version. We're gonna show you how this is wired up on the four channel version. It has a power supply connected on the input side, V positive and V negative. And then we have the four channels output going to a strip. Now let's flip this around and look at the signal side. Now this looks a little different than other decoders you've looked at. This has the RJ45 connector, like we've already seen, that you can run your signal in. But this also gives the flexibility of having XLR ports. So if you have an existing DMX system and want to use a decoder, the XLR ports gives you this added functionality. Now to set the DMX address on this, there's no display screen. Instead, you have dip switches right here. And you may look at that and wonder, well, how do I get 512 addresses out of that? The easiest way to set one of these is to use a handy app. So today I'm just using a DMX app. You can just search for that on the internet and they all work the same. You just set the address you want. We want to do address 62 and it tells you which way to flip the dip switches and then just match what it says. So the first one down and the last three down. Now this is set to DMX address 62. All right, we've done all of this with the function switch in the off position. That's what you need to do when you're doing the DMX addresses. Now when we turn the fun on, we have lots of color presets. So with fun on and one down, we get a preset red, two down, green, blue, yellow, magenta, cyan, and then this is an RGBW strip, so the white chip has its own channel. Turn that one on. And now the last two, eight and nine, are both color sequences. We turn on eight, it's a clipping pattern. And turn on nine, it's a nice panning program. And that's all the features of the DMX 512 decoder with XLR ports. For more helpful information, like and subscribe.